What's up you guys, it's Isaac with a chance here, here for my ninth video review. And today we're going to be looking at Transformers, Transformers Studio Series, Decepticon Crowbar. And so for the package on this, so, so for the package, um, he does, so there's a picture of him and he, and there inside the box, you'll see him and all his two weapons. And there's a logo that says Transformers on it, and, and this was made by Hasbro. And he is number three because he is from Transformers Dark of the Moon. So if y'all didn't see him in Dark of the Moon, I don't think he was an action figure for Dark of the Moon. I'm not sure. I think he was. And then, anyway, so he, so here's another picture of him, of Crow. Here's another another picture of Crowbar. And then on the back, here's another another one. And here's another one as well. And it says Studio Series. And he is number three, like I said. Excuse me. And here he is in the robot mode and truck mode. And he has 20 steps. And and you'll see some other other photos. I mean other I mean other toys like Bumblebee, Stinger, and Ratchet. That I already have these three, including Optimus Prime. Right right over there. He is right behind me. I know y'all can't see him. <clears throat> I think y'all can. I don't think so. But anyway. So here, cause he already from he, like I said, he is from Dark with the Transform Dark with the Moon, cause he was, it was, I think he was in the scene where him and Sights, no Ironhide and Sideswipe, um, fight the Crankcase and Crowbar. I think Crankcase is the one with the dreads, with the dreadlocks. Looks like Berserker from Transform the Last Night. <clears throat> Anything else? Um, okay, nothing much now. So, so on the package of this guy, so that's about it. So let's get Crowbar out and see how awesome he actually is. So here we have Crowbar in, so we have Crowbar out of his package and, and, and also in his, um, his SUV black truck, um, the reason why I had trouble, so I really apologize. He was hard to transform. Actually, he wasn't hard to transform. It's just that the dreads, these dreads are in the way. Like Hasbro could at least took the dreads off. When you put him in robot mode, you could put the dreads, put the dreads on the guy. It will probably help. So I really like the. Um, it won't stay on. I'm, I'm gonna leave it alone. <laughs> I'm having dreads. <laughs> He won't, he won't attach together. The reason why he won't attach together because of the problems. Um, um, it's fine. I'll just leave it like it is for now. So here we have. So anyway, so his so the truck is was the, so the truck was black, like it is. Um, he does have the same um vehicle mode as Berserker from the last night. No, what's his name? Crankcase. Well, yeah. Well, him and, well, he does look more like Dreadbot, but Dreadbot is kind of, look like, um, Crowbar. So, his dreads are sticking out, and I do not know why. Hasbro could have at least took the dreads off. It's all Hasbro's fault. <laughs> Hasbro's your fault, but I like... I like Hasbro, but sometimes I just I just don't like the way they make Transformers transform so hard, or, and people are just or you know some people are just having a little trouble with the transformation. But I'll get used to it. It's fine. So he does have the um the red sirens up top, and they look and these sirens are black when they're supposed to be blue. Um, I think he's some kind of government type SUV. I'm not sure what kind of SUV he is. He is a black SUV though, but he is a, but he is a um, Chevy because this says Chevy on it. I really like the logo because Bumblebee is a Chevy Camaro as well. Because but this but this truck is a more like a SUV Chevy type truck. And his um his his windshield and the windows are more like dark blue 
because it's more like a navy blue type color and I really like the way Hasbro took their time but I just don't like the way they get the dreads in the way when you put them in truck mode but it's okay I got used to this figure so and speaking of speaking of crowbar he does come with the menu um, I don't really use the menu I just never watch the videos on YouTube or just do it on my own he does come with the um I wish they would take the dreads out like barely like it'll be bad if they did take the dreads out okay so so yeah I wish they would take the dread the dreads off this guy when they when y'all when somebody puts him in truck mode will probably help and he does come with the um he does come with this um this box this um with the set when him and where him hatchet and um crankcase went on a highway chase to chase bumblebee sam dino and sideswipe in transformers 3 dark of the moon because it says dark of the moon right here um and dark of the moon it's one of my favorites. You know, mostly I like I like all the Transformers films. And here is the highway still. So that's where that's where the dreads transformed. And he does come with these these sharp weapons. They look really sharp. When I took these off, when I took these out of the box, they look a lot sharp like really like they look pointy Ooh, i didn't mean to bend them i had to take them out of the box it was an accident um anything else oh you can also attach the where can i attach these yeah i don't know where to attach them right now i hate to tell you the truth but I don't know where to attach these because <laughs> they say you're supposed to attach them. Let me check. Let me double check the menu. Where is the menu? Here's the menu. All right, then. We'll have to do this the hard way. So, let me look at the back of the menu real quick. Oh, okay. So, oh, you can attach these then. Um, but, oh, you see these? My fault. So, you see these. So, you can attach this right here. Let me get it in. Try to get it in. Get in. Get in. Thank you. Oh, you don't want to get in. Oh, well. I'll get you. I'll, get, I'll be fine. Okay. Okay. So now Crowbar has his weapons. I'm sorry I bent them because I took them out of the box. That's my fault. Well, I think he's going to use these. I think because they look like... They, I'm not sure what kind of weapons these are. They look like some kind of spike sharp type weapons. Yeah, and that's about it with Crowbar. Um, So let's get down to transformation. His trans... So... So um I'm not gonna talk, I'm not gonna talk about his transformation. His transformation looks a little quick to me. Um just a little quick, not really quick quick. So that's all this is all I can transform into, but I just took my time transforming him because these dreads were in the way. Hasbro could at least move the dreads out of the way just in case they want to transform the truck. Put him in the robot, you put the dreads on the back of his head, and that's about it. That's all they gotta do. So anyway. So, first you want to, let me start with this side. So, so you want to start taking, come on. I mean, I'm sorry, my hand gets in the way. I hate when my hand gets in the way, like I always say. Okay, got it. So, you want to take the legs down. Um, take the other leg down. Hold on, let me do it on this side. I got it. And then, I'm going to start down here first. So, you want to twist. Hang on. So, you want to twist 
the thighs like that and you want to take these things down the same on this oh and wait sorry and you want to put the feet out and you want to take this tire out make it look like the heel and then you do the same on this side so you want to take this down Just like that. And you want to take this out, like I always say, and twist the thigh, however you want it. Then you want to go back here, um, get this out of the way. And you want to put the windshield up, just like that. And you want to, let me start with the arms first. So, so you start with the top. So, you want to take this black piece out, just like that. Oops, sorry, sorry. Fold this down. My hand gets in the way all the time. And you wanna, you wanna do, okay, you don't do anything with these then, okay. So you wanna, so afterwards, the, you wanna take these, you wanna take these arms, put them down, put his arms down. like that and you can bend these and you want to put this in the back fold it back just like that and you put this in the back however you guys want it or or you can stick it just like that sorry my hand gets in the way and I don't like it You want to take the backpack and put it right on this back. And you want to put these in the back now. All right. You guys can come on out now. Oh, oh well. Just leave it. And you want to take the hands. So these hands will come on out. Um, well. Okay. Hang on a second. I'm out. Got him, got him, got it. Do the same on this hand. Take this out. And hopefully this should be it. And that's, oh. I really want to take these things down. I'm having dread problems with this guy. He's giving me a hard time. But it's okay. I'm getting used to crowbar it's transformation and you put his head back just like that and now there you have crowbar wait double check okay that's everything there you have crowbar in his robot mode so he does look more like dreadbot from transformers the last night but he looks because i'm not talking about the body i'm talking about the face So that's about it. So that's all I know. Stay down, dreads. The dreads don't want to stay down because I put them in transformation. So crowbar actually looks really good, but he looks quite like dread dreadbot from the last night, like I always say. They could have made him as a toy, but I guess Hasbro seen dark with the moon because Michael Bay just made these transformers look the same face. They probably got the same faces over and over again. So, so, so with the head sculpt looks like a, looks like, he looks like, um, looks like a vampire to me. And, um, the teeth just comes out and you wanna, so, and then, um, these hands, I think he's putting out his finger, his bad finger. <laughs> so, so you can attach these in just like that and i'll do the same on this side and there's crowbar he's ready for action so that's crowbar and his body actually so 
So, um, his dreads, I know they get in the way sometimes, and I don't know why they get in the way, like, like, uh, like I, I just said. So, that's all I gotta say about Crowbar. Oh, well, I got used to him anyway, so, his transformation, I transformed him fine, so... So that's all I gotta say to this video. I know he looks a little quite different than, um, what's his name? Berserker and Crankcase, because they are the dreads anyway. So that's all I gotta say to about, about, um, Crowbar. So be sure to su subscribe, comment down below, follow me on Instagram. Because I'm, and tomorrow I'm getting ready to review, tomorrow I'm going to review Eric Killmonger, a.k.a. Golden Jaguar. And I'll see y'all tomorrow.